Arch Enemy. Brand new song, which means we gotta react to it. It's time for reaction. Hey everybody, my name is Flu School Nerd, because <laughs> I have the flu, but I'm highly medicated and I'm here, which means I'm happy, my nose is clear, I'm not coughing, which is awesome, everything from here down is still sore because it's the flu, but I'm trapped in my media room, isolated from the rest of my family, so I might as well do reactions, let's go. Wait, hold on, maybe I should do it in a different way. No, not going to work like that? Okay, fine. All right, so if you appreciate what we're doing, as always, please. And put a like. All right, so here we go. Arch Enemy, brand new one. It's called House of Mirrors. Arch Enemy's been around for a very long time, like 20 years plus. And as they continue to develop, they try to find new ways to uh, bring their music to out there. I'm going to be looking for things that are not the standard fare. Let's see what they do. Is it going to be just standard power chords the whole way through? Or are we going to have some dynamic in there? Anything's possible. Check us out on oldschoolnerd.com. It's got all the social media posts. The Patreon link for those who want to help support the channel and help me pay for my flu medications. It's a joke. I'm kidding. And the merchandise store. Don't have a flu shirt. Don't look for it. Here we go. Arch Enemy, House of Mirrors. And for those who are asking me in the comments, if you did an Arch Enemy's new one, why don't you do Infected Rain's new one? It came out today too. I will. It comes out tomorrow, right before Leo. Deal? Deal. Let's do this. I like that. That walk down is really nice. I like that. Will it be reprised? Or is it just an intro? Build up? The power metal scream. Oh, I like that. Okay. Okay, I like that. I like that. I like that. The intro walk where he walks down that scale in that intro tag, that, that hook he's doing on the guitar, I really, really, really like the way that he's doing it in, as a reprisal in the chorus. It adds a depth. It adds a dynamic. We're not just going to run through power chords the whole time. There has to be something more. When you've been in the game, as long as Arch Enemy is, you're always finding a new way to connect with the fans. I like this. This is what you got to do. Can't just sit back on your laurels. You got to be something new all the time, which is why I keep adding shit to my wall. And I have the flu. Next week, I'm going to see if I can get rickets just to be new. You don't even know what rickets is, do you? Vitamin D deficiency. I don't have it. Let's go. Ooh. Not a guitar solo, but a tag. That was nice. There it is. I like that hook, man. Oh, 
Oh, bridge build up. Epic guitar solo? Maybe? Probably. It's Arch Enemy. <laughs> We gotta talk. We gotta talk about that. I don't. I don't like stopping videos if I don't have to. Uh, I usually do it for um, for copyright reasons, but in this case, it doesn't matter because the label knew I was doing it, and they're like, "Hey, please react to this." I'm like, "Okay." So I think it's gonna be okay. But I want to stop it because this is very important. That was really really cool. Come on, how many times in the history of Arch Enemy and all power metal going back? 20, 30 years, okay? The typical thing is to build up the bridge and then go to a guitar solo where the guitar soloist pulls all the way up as high as he or she can go to the pickups and just tries to piss every dog and bird off in a mile, you know, just squeeching and squealing like you're sticking a pig with a stick, right? He did the exact opposite. He did this transition, this bridge transition in there. And then if you check it out, he, he drops in and he's, I just want to catch it. He's way down close. Like he's one, two, three, four, five frets from the end of the neck. And he's doing the guitar solo, but he's sitting in that mid range, mid range of notes rather than going super high. That I like. Why? It's completely different. It's not the normal. Normal doesn't cut it anymore. If you've been around as long as Arch Enemy has for years, decades, they can actually say the word decades when they talk about their career. You can't just keep throwing out the cookie cutter. And it's not just Arch Enemy, it's a lot of bands. We have a lot of new, young, hungry bands that are taking musicianship and they're going through the roof with it. So a lot of your established stars are like, okay, we need to turn the page on this. We need to come up with our own dynamic that, can, that puts our message out there. It's not a competition. It is a family. It's a community across the world with music. But at the same time, you want to stay relevant. That's fucking relevant. That's great stuff. And it's not just the flu cough syrup talking. Yeah. My cough syrup is awesome, but it's... This is too. Uh, it's the kind of thing where I realize that it's, that's a great shot, by the way. Um, this is also one of those things where I remember that, yes, I know the music's supposed to be playing and you guys are going to be murdering me in the comments. Watch, please shut the hell up and let the video play. I am, but here's the thing. It's my channel. So when I have something I want to share with everyone, I'm going to share it and then I'm going to shut the hell up. And you know what? I'm going to shut the hell up now because I'm rambling because I'm on medicine. And we're going to go and listen to this whole solo situation. See if you know what I'm talking about. It's just different. And it's a good different. Okay, the build up. Here comes the guitar section, the lead in. That is so slick. Another one. Again, he's not sitting in the high end. All right, going up. That's amazingly good. 
That's amazingly good. Okay, so think about it like this. In all the stuff they did, in everything that they worked through, that entire bridge solo section with two different guitars doing two different types of solos, and all of that, out of all that, what, 20, 30 seconds of time in this music uh, ensemble, this little setup, four seconds? Four seconds of it was in the traditional high-end guitar area. Everything else was in a melodic tone further down the neck. That's great stuff. That makes me excited for the new Arch Enemy. I love it. I love the new stuff. I think it's great. I think they're starting to step out and say we're not going to do anything that's cookie cutter. I mean, they never have. But post, you know, in 2021, as you're getting close to the end of the year, like I said, you have all these young and hungry bands that are taking musicianship and they're saying, you know what? We're going to step outside the box. We're going to step outside the norm. And we want to gather people to realize what we can do. And Arch Enemy just did that. And I think it's one of their better songs. I really like this song a lot. My name is Old School Nerd, and if you like this, as I always said, and put a like. And as always, to all of you out there, please take care of yourselves. Love one another. And from me to you, well, and also Gojira. Muchas fucking gracias. Hey, fun. Hey.